Hey everybody, Cooper here at E-Trailer, and today we're going to be taking a look at the WeatherTech Cargo Liner on our 2021 Nissan Rogue. We do have the black version here in our Nissan Rogue because it does kind of complement our interior, but if you're looking for other color options, there are some available here at E-Trailer. Now for a cargo liner like this, whether you're carrying around camping gear, fishing gear, or anything for your bike ride or just those everyday items, this is going to provide a really nice cargo liner for the back of your vehicle. And it's honestly one of my favorite ones from WeatherTech, because as you can see, we're only gonna have one for our back area, but if we choose to put that third row down, we're going to have more space as well. And we don't have to pull these extra ones out if we choose to fold up our seats, since it is actually technically one giant piece. We'll show you putting up those seats later, but it's actually all going to still stay within the vehicle. We can see that we have a very good contour to our vehicle, fitting up against all the different types of crevices that we have cut out for our vehicle. In the back here, we do have a little bit of the rise, but that's just from the memory of being in the box. Overall, over time, it will work itself out to be a little bit more flat. One of the benefits though, is that it, since it doesn't secure itself down, we do still have access to our spare tire compartment down here without having to undo anything. As we talked about before, our mat is technically one piece, but there is this really nice cutout here on the mat that gives us the ability to just go ahead and put up only one of our seats if we want to, so we don't have to put up both, which is really nice. And the way that it's going to stay up here is actually with these two hook and loop patches that we have on the back of the mat securing to the back of our seat. The best way we have found to fold up one of our seats is to kind of put pressure on where it hinges, which just encourages it to keep the best shape possible while also going up. There is an included cutout here. So for our booster seats or child seats, we still do have that anchor point and there is a high wall around that. So if you have any sort of spill, dirt or grime, it will be encouraged to funnel away from this hole. In addition to those nice cutouts that we saw earlier with those high walls, we do have these nice deep channels in our mat which is just going to help encourage any dirt grime or spills to fall into these channels while keeping our items on the more raised section, just making sure that they're not sitting there soaking into it or whenever you take the item out, it's not bringing out that dirt or grime with it. Our whole entire mat is going to be made of this really nice rubberized thermoplastic, which just means it's going to stand up to the years and years of putting in items. It's going to be very scratch resistant any sort of spills that come in contact with it or cleaning those spills up. It is going to stand that test of time. Overall, honestly, I would say that this is my favorite WeatherTech liner that I've dealt with so far. Its ability to be both for our back hatch and if we put our second row seating down, all while remaining to be one piece is actually very impressive. While WeatherTech liners are pretty great on their own, I just think that that added additional feature is something really, really cool. That was a look at our WeatherTech cargo liner and our 2021 Nissan Rogue. Thanks for watching.